No. 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 What am I going to do now, eh, Vivian? What the fuck? Too late, Bigby. She's dead. What the fuck happened, Georgie? What's it look like? I'm really not in the mood, Bigby. <coughs> so why don't you just fuck off? Start oh. talking, Georgie. <sighs> oh, you think that'll help? I told you I don't want to fucking talk. Especially not with a piece of shit like you. So just leave me the fuck alone. If you don't talk, you're gonna end up like her. I didn't do shit to her. She killed herself. She did it. Just pulled her ribbon off right there. Didn't fucking matter what I said. She always did what she wanted. She just... Right in front of me. Why the hell would she do that? <clears throat> She said she'd had enough. She couldn't live with what she'd done. She's the original Big Bit. The girl with the ribbon. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. We used hers to make the rest. It started as part of the gimmick, right? Discretion is our guarantee. You know, she came up with that. It was her idea. Whoever thought it would end this way. Fuck. She always had good ideas, that one. This was our place, Big B. She was in it from the beginning. But then everything went to shit. This was just the final fucking straw. She felt responsible for Faith and Lily. <coughs> what her ribbons did to them. Said she'd rather die on her own terms. For something good. Or at least something close to it. So she ended it. Oh, it didn't matter if that left me to deal with this fucking mess. We promised we'd look out for each other. So what the fuck is this? Just leaving me here. Look, I know you think it's my fault. That I killed him for some twisted pleasure of mine. But I... <coughs> I did what I had to. You don't always get a choice. Sometimes you just have to do what you're told. And then it comes back to bite you in the ass because some good-for-nothing <coughs> crooked bastard decides you're not worth shit anymore. You didn't have to do anything. Like hell, I didn't. Some of the girls decided to pull a runner on us. And the crooked man didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says, or I'm the one getting dealt with. I had to do it. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill those girls. And then he fucking sold me out. <coughs> None of this would have happened if it wasn't for that bastard. It's his fucking fault. All of it. Oh, fuck. Get up. Get up. Don't think so, Bigby. <sighs> I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Really fuck him up for me, all right? He's gonna have it worse. Don't worry. Good. Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. You want to finish me off now? <laughs> or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Rip my limbs off one by one? That's what you want to do, right? Well, whatever it is, just get it over with. That's not who I am. Prove it, then. No more games, all right? We both know how this ends. <laughs> just make it quick. I know what I did. <laughs> Let's not draw this out. All right, Georgie. 